the force P has magnitude of 250 Newton and is applied at the end C of a 500 millimeter rod AC attached to a bracket at A and B. Assuming alpha is 30 degrees, beta is 60 degrees, replace P with an equivalent force coupled system at B and B an equivalent system formed by two parallel forces applied at A and B. So let us try solving this problem here. So if you look at this liver ABC, I have point A here, B and C. The force P is that is 250 Newton is given in the question. Okay. And it is applied at an angle of 60 degrees this angle being 60 degrees and alpha is given to be 30 degrees which in fact leaves this angle to be 90 degrees so in order to shift this force p 250 newton from this point to this point b i just have to move this force by 0.3 meters so my equivalent force would be f is equal to 250 newtons and my equivalent moment would be m about point b which is 250 into 0 0.3 which will give you 75 newton meters and if you see this force is trying to rotate it in the clockwise direction so i'll put it with this arrow so this is the equivalent force and the equivalent moment so i have found out my part a now moving to part b part b says an equivalent system formed by two parallel forces applied at a and b so let us assume again i'm just drawing the free body diagram here this is 90 degrees 250 newtons that at point b there will be a force fb and at point a also there is a force fa now if you consider these forces an equivalent system so that means the effect of fa fb which is acting at some angle phi we do not know right now let us assume that to be an angle of phi okay and these distances are fixed 0 0.3 and 0 0.2 okay, this point being a b and c the forces fa and fp should create the same moment as the 250 newton force about point b but there is a catch here it should be remaining it in equilibrium let us consider the equilibrium forces or the equilibrium equations and for easiness i am assuming an x and y axis like this so for equilibrium equations let us consider sigma fx equal to 0 which implies fa cos phi plus fb cos phi should be equal to 0 which leaves us with two options one is fa is equal to minus fp or cos phi should be equal to zero now we will revisit this based on the other set of equilibrium equation that is sigma fy equal to zero which implies i have the force fa acting like this fb acting like this and 250 newton also acting in the negative directions I have assumed it that way so what i would get f a sine phi okay and that sine component will definitely be in the negative direction minus f a sine phi minus f b sine phi minus 250 is equal to zero if i substitute f a equal to minus f b I get fb sin phi minus fb sin phi these two terms will get cancelled out and i get minus 250 equal to zero which is not possible 
so i will completely eliminate this option so remaining is cos phi is equal to 0 which implies phi would be 90 degrees so i have this equation coming out to be minus fa sin 90 minus fb sin 90 minus 250 is equal to 0 so you have the final equation coming out to be fa plus fb is equal to minus 250 newtons okay now let us consider the moment about the point b sigma mb should be equal to 0 in that case what i would get i would get fa into point 2 and this 250 into point 3 these are the two forces which are acting and it creates a moment about point b and it is interesting to note phi has become 90 degrees so i have directly fa into point 2 and how does it try to rotate about point b anti clockwise direction so i have fa into 0 0.2 that is in the clock anti clockwise direction and 250 into 250 into 0 0.3 so this 250 into 0.3 is acting in the clockwise direction so it is minus to be equal to 0 so what do i get which implies i have fa is equal to this 250 minus 250 into 0.3 goes to the other side of the equation so fa i would get it to be 375 newtons Now substitute this over here. What do I get? Fb is equal to 2 minus 250, and here it is 375. It goes into the other side, and it turns out to be minus 625 newtons. So now coming to the angles, it will be acting in 90 degrees with respect to the uh, lever, that is lever AC. So I have my final answer as Fa is equal to 375 newtons and 375 newtons I have got it as in the positive y direction so 375 newtons acting at an angle of this angle being 60 so the remaining with respect to positive x would be 120 degrees and fb would be 625 minus 625 so that means it is in this direction 625 newtons acting at an angle of uh, if you see this is 60 so that means 360 minus 60 so acting at an angle of 300 degrees so i have my answer for my part b as well so this covers the topic of moment of a couple and equivalent force couple system i hope you have understood the problems that I have solved in the class. If you do have feedbacks, please post it in the form of comments. It will be really great to hear from you so that I can improve my lectures in the coming weeks. Thank you.